Did you know that you can use a calculator to help you when evaluating algebraic expressions? Let's take a look at how to do this. Here's our algebraic expression. x squared plus 4x plus 3 divided by 2x squared minus 9x minus 5. And x is equal to 7. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to substitute 7 anywhere we see an x. Here we have 7 squared plus 4 times 7 plus 3 in the numerator. And we have 2 times 7 squared minus 9 times 7 minus 5 in the denominator. Now we can use our calculator. One of the most wonderful things about the calculator is we can actually put all of the numerator into the calculator simply by entering it. So we can put 7 squared plus 4 times 7 plus 3 into our calculator. And what will happen is our calculator automatically knows to use the order of operations. Here's the order of operations once again at the bottom of the screen. Parentheses, exponents, multiplication and division in order from left to right, and addition subtraction in order from left to right. The calculator in its memory already knows to do that. So when you put this whole first part of the algebraic expression into the calculator, it will solve it according to the order of operations. And when we evaluate the numerator, we have an answer of 80. Now I'm going to write in the denominator because we haven't worked with that yet. So we have 2 times 7 squared minus 9 times 7 minus 5 in the denominator. Next, we're going to take this whole quantity and put it into the calculator. And again, the calculator will know to use the order of operations to solve it. So when we do that, 2 times 7 squared minus 9 times 7 minus 5 is going to give us 80 in the numerator and 30 in the denominator. Now, if you weren't using your calculator, you would have to do this math a long way. And we would do 30 divided into 80. We'd start off with 2. This would be 60. Bring down the 20. Decimal 0. Bring down the 0. And on and on and on and on. However, by using the calculator, we can do the simple division. And when we divide 80 by 30, we get 2.6666. Seven. And we can round that to 2.7, or we can simply leave it 2.66. Using the calculator has supported us in evaluating the algebraic expression.